perfectly rational and probably even immature decision I just made. Uh, so I found the car, as you could see from the title of the video, uh, it's E46 M3 and I'm on my way to pick it up. I rented this car at Portland Airport and I'm on my way. I have to drive like nine hours to get to the place where the car is located and it's probably like the title says midlife crisis signs at its best and I'm gonna film my trip in this rental if there's gonna be something interesting but looks like it's gonna go into rain right now and I don't think it's gonna be anything interesting it's just gonna be night driving and I'm gonna listen to some books and listen to music Way to the place where I'm going to pick up M3 and I've got a Flores rental and I almost got there I was driving all night and the place where I'm meeting uh, this person who's selling this car is going to be in Sacramento airport and I'm like probably five minutes away from the place and the drive was normal nothing really happened yeah it was long and boring <laughs> it's about 600 miles from the place where I live yeah, and right now is my exit here so I'm gonna show you car in just one second and here we have it guys I just bought 2003 LCI version of E46 M3 convertible and the car is almost stuck it's six-speed manual it's gonna be a really fast introduction it has a Dynan short shifter and also it has a Borla exhaust I'm gonna show it to you guys later and I specifically wanted the version without navigation because I think it is so outdated right now and if you swap it to Android version it will work fine but I think it looks much cleaner and let me turn the car on I'll show you guys that it has I think it has 94,000 miles yeah it has 94,000 miles almost 95,000 miles and everything works great except it has few uh, things here and there let me show you guys how engine bay looks like the engine bay looks super clean one bracket on this trim over here is broken but it's not a big deal it's not visible Overall, I'm very happy with the condition of the car. I bought it for $8,000 and it has 18 inch wheels. And I'm gonna do more in depth introduction when I'm gonna get home because right now I'm in California. And yeah, I still have to drive like 600 miles back home. Let me show you the rear seats and like Usually on these cars, the real seats look super nice, almost no signs of use. And the top, soft top, is also in very good condition. So I started driving back to Portland area um, and car is doing fine. The road is a little bit bumpy. This is the pass over this, uh, I believe this is a rice field over here and uh, temperature is fine just a little update on the exhaust on Borla exhaust and uh, I thought it's gonna be much louder considering the soft top of the convertible it's not bad I'm cruising at 80 miles per hour right now six speed and uh, 
Yeah, it's not bothering me. First full stop. Oh boy, that boat is so loud. So I stopped at this lake over here. Looks like a river, but it's actually a Shasta Lake or Shasta Lake. Not sure how you pronounce it correctly. And just wanted to take a few shots of new to me, my BMW E46 M3. So far the trip is going well. Fueled up only once, as you guys could see. There is a I-5 bridge and I'm enjoying my car so far. Borla exhaust is not obnoxious and it's not super loud when you're driving, so it's not bad. I actually like it. Uh, I can hear a little bit of droning when it's like a first and second gear, but it's not bothering me right now. pulled in for my last fuel stop and everything is going fine it's a beautiful day kind of windy a little bit tried to drive with open top for a few hours it was nice but when I entered the Oregon it started to be super windy so I had to get the top back again yeah gas is a little bit cheaper than in California I'm getting super unleaded, it's 283 right now, yeah. Very surprised how efficient this car is, uh, tank about 14 gallons I would say, maybe like 15, because I didn't fill up it, I didn't go all the way down, and the computer says it's less approximately 400 miles. Yeah and i didn't push it very hard so i was just driving normally like going maybe five miles over the speed limit so yeah car drives great yeah you can see computer says 405 right now estimated miles yeah car drives great everything's fine i should be home in approximately two and a half three hours portion is filmed a few days later. I wanted to film how Borla exhaust sounds. This is going to be a cold start. This is my setup. set up the car is properly warmed up let's do some revs and I can hear a little bit of droning around two three thousand rpms and it's probably not secured all the way so yeah we have to look at that 
and now I got my mic taped to the bumper. Let me do some driving. It's not gonna be a really long driving, but it's gonna go around the block. You guys can see here what's going on. This board exhaust. 